All right, my friends, welcome back to Frog Boy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew, and today this is going to be a short little tutorial on how to enable your frame rate counter, your frame 1% uh, lows, um, all of that stuff on MSI Afterburner. So, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into this, um, and then obviously you're monitoring or whatever. When you come all the way down to where it says your frame rate, your frame, your frame, frame time, uh, frame rate max, 1% low, 0% one lows, frame rate average, all of that stuff. As you can see, they're all checked. If you click on one and then you, um, then you'll enable it right here, show on display. And then you can do like your text or you can do text and graph, whatever you want to do. Hit apply on that. But then you're wondering like, okay, I did all that. I'm in the game. I can't seem to see any of the other stuff. Well, you're right. You need to go over here to on screen display then you're going to come on down here it's going to say more then you're going to come down here a little bit more and you're going to hit setup and then you're going to take this bad boy let me see if i can get that up there a little bit you're going to take this bad boy and you're going to scroll all the way down and then you're going to say and then where it says compatibility properties you're going to come right down here to enable benchmark mode once you click this on and then you hit ok that there is going to give you all the rest of the information that you have um, in your monitoring section. So most of the stuff will show up like your GPU temperature, GPU usage, your memory, all of that stuff will usually just show up right in there. But until you actually go into um, on-screen display, hit more, come down here to setup and then scroll all the way down on the first page and enable benchmark mode, you will not have those popping up on there. So, all right, my friends, if you like this content, hit that like, hit that subscribe. We will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.